Hi, it's Beck here from Sunbury Local Businesses and I'm here with Michael again from Sage Business Group. How are you, Michael? Really good, thanks, Beck. Really That's good. good. Um, so what are we going to be talking about today? Well, yeah, planning. Um, I keep referencing back to a book, uh, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen Covey. Yeah. And one of the things he says is we have to begin with the end in mind. Mm -hmm. And for business, that means having an idea of what your business is going to provide for you in terms of cash and, and time. Uh, but also for financial planning or your financial planning freedom uh, plan, what, what do you want to be doing when you retire? How much do you want to earn? How much do mm -hmm. you want to live on? So begin with that end in mind is really important mm -hmm. um, because you need a reference point. We're going through the business life cycle and there's so, much thing, so many things being thrown at you. Mm -hmm. Um, where does it fit? But if we can reference it back to what we want to get out of our business, what we want to get out of our planning personally, yeah. um, we can determine whether it's, it's junk yeah. or in actual fact it's an important piece of our plan. Yeah. So I actually um, think that planning is a bit like doing a really big jigsaw puzzle. Mm -hmm. In the really old days we had jigsaw puzzles and how much easier is it to do the jigsaw puzzle when we've got the box on the side with the completed project? So true. Uh, and if you've got something to reference to, um, you can work out whether you know, you're on the right track or you're not yeah. on the right track. Um, again, does it form part of the overall plan? So planning is really important. That's what we do here at Sage Business Group is we get our clients really clear on the plan, whether it be for business or financial planning. Okay, and then you also mentioned accountability before. Mm. Absolutely. probably. One of the um, most important points, but least actually actioned upon, mm. because most business plans or financial plans, they go in the top drawer mm. and we don't reference them again. True. So we need to su uh, surround ourselves with people that can actually just hold us to account, make sure we're on track, off track, um, give guidance where possible. And again, it's really important. So we decided that we would introduce that here at Sage Business Group. For business people, we can uh, introduce the accountability around making sure that they're gonna do what they say they're going to do. Um, that word gonna, get it out of the vocabulary. Um, not good. So, um, yeah, so working towards having a plan and then wrapping some accountability around it, really important. Fabulous. Okay, and so if you guys provide that here, how should people reach out? Certainly by um, phoning the office mm -hmm. um, and contact us via website. In actual fact, what we'll do is, for the first five people that come into the office, mm -hmm. we'll give you a copy of the seven habits of highly effective people. Ooh. So come in um, and get your free copy, but yeah. certainly contact us and, and we can set, get together and, and set a plan for you. Yeah, sounds fabulous. All right, well, thanks so much for your time, Michael. No problems, Beck.